So the system configuration matters after installation. Stick to this video to learn something about your solar energy system. Hi guys, my name is Merigan Emmanuel, uh, your favorite solar energy guide. I know I've talked about this like in two of my videos or three of my videos where I told you guys to configure your system after installation. But I'm still surprised that a lot of people still chat me up on WhatsApp asking me how to configure their system. Two reasons why you should always configure your system after installation. One is to avoid uh, deep discharge. For example, if you don't set your inverter, especially Chinese inverter, if you don't set them to uh, the low voltage disconnect, which the battery manufacturer recommends, you end up draining your battery too deep. And if it's lithium ion battery, it will not come up. You have to come and do some direct charge if your inverter is not communicating with your system. Another thing is uh, your inverter will be sensing DC over voltage. Yes, your inverter will sense DC over voltage because at times, if you don't configure your system after installation, the flow voltage or the absorb voltage of some charge controller gets to as high as let's assume you are using a 24 volt it gets as high as 29 or 30 volts if you don't configure that from a solar charge controller your inverter will be sensing dc over voltage and it will be going off during the day so the best way to configure your system one you need manual either the inverter manual or the battery manual two you have to check the battery specification these are the two things you need to configure your system and what should you take note of when configuring your system one is the float or absorb voltage two is the low voltage disconnect take note of these two things when you want to configure your system to enjoy the best or to get the best from your solar energy system if you find this video useful don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to turn on your notification buttons for more useful tips or educational videos on solar energy system like this